This training video will show you how to change the system code and channel of your translator. Using the four push buttons down the bottom right hand corner, we press down until RF is displayed. We press right, it says EHP, press right again and it says SIS. This is where we change our system code. Press right and the current system code of your translator is displayed. Using the up and down buttons, scroll up or down until the system code you require is displayed. I'm going to change this translator system code to 10. Once you've got that number, press right, and it goes back to the word SIS, and a little icon of a house has appeared. The house icon means you have changed your system settings, but you haven't yet written this new information into the translator's memory. Now we can change our channel. Press down, and it says CH, which means channel. Press right, and the current channel of your translator is displayed. Using the up and down buttons, scroll around until the channel you require is displayed. I'm going to change this translator to channel 1 and press right and it goes back to the word CH and the house is still there. Now we need to write these new settings into the translator's memory. Press down and you see the word init which means initialize. Press right and it says confirm. Are you sure you want to write these new settings into the translator's memory? Press right and you get four little zeros, which means please wait a moment. As soon as it's finished writing the new information, it will say done. Press left until the screen is blank.